gather round, children, and I shall tell you the fable of the three blondes who went camping. First off, we had the tall blonde, as, well, he's the tallest blonde. Secondly, we had the short blonde because, well, she's the shortest blonde. And thirdly, we have the, uh, uh, what kind of blonde are you? Ah, okay, well, we needed three blondes. First off, the blondes decided to make their beds. The tall blonde apparently had not bought a new sleeping bag since he was a child, and, well, it was too small. The second blonde, well, she apparently does not understand how a sleeping bag works and has put it on her head and is um, walking into the wall of the tent. Are you all right? And the third blonde, well, clearly she's the smarter one. She got it just right. Doesn't she look comfy? Next, the blondes decided to build fires. The tall blonde, well, he built his out of matches, which burned very, very quickly and was too small. The short blonde decided to build a fire with a tree that was still in the ground. She seems to be having some trouble with that. Luckily, a forest fire was in fact prevented that day. The third blonde, as you can see, was actually successful in building her fire. Apparently she knew what she was doing. Next, the blondes decided to roast marshmallows and well, the tall blonde, well, his is raw. The short blonde, well, perhaps we should keep her away from fire. She uh, seems to be a bit of a pyro. Not quite sure she should be eating that. Is she going to eat it? Oh dear. Oh, I, I do believe she is. And the third blonde, well, she got her marshmallow just right. Well, children, I'm not quite sure what the moral of this fable is, but remember, do not chase your friend with shovels. Or with marshmallows, for that matter. Single way, marshmallow.